Howdy folks, welcome to vlog 175. I think I skipped a few videos to get to 175, but there's a good reason for it. Today I'm honoring Marshall University. When people think of Marshall University, they think of the football team that dominated the 1990s as Division I AA national champions in 1992 and 1996. And I love going to football games with my family. It's just kind of a nice tradition that I like to do. It's a great time in Huntington, West Virginia. <laughs> But on November 14th, 1970, the Marshall University football team was flying home from an away game against East Carolina University. As they were making their final approach to Tri-State Airport, the aircraft crashed into a hillside, claiming the lives of all 75 people on board, from players, coaches, and supporters, along with the flight crew on board. A memorial fountain was made on campus to honor those lost. Every November 14th, hundreds of students and faculty have an annual fountain ceremony where they turn off the fountain to remember those 75 people, which is the deadliest tragedy affecting any sports team in U.S. history. Every year on the evening at 7.15 p.m., family, friends of the departed, including first responders that were on the scene that tragic night, will meet at the crash site. And at 7.36 p.m., the moment the flight crashed into the hillside, they hold a moment of silence to remember the 75 lives that were lost. I hope you're dancing in the sky. In 2018, two students joined the group. Usually students and faculty never attend this event. So I challenge anyone that watches this video to be the one that honors the 75 at this moment of silence. Show your true colors and support Marshall University. I'm Jay Silverman. Thanks for watching and go herd. I hope you're dancing.